This is a passage from his 10 security 4. I believe it's electrons, magnetism, electrons, and sleep. It says, as we, so as we age, we lose our magnetic sense, loss of electrons. And this effect is profound on our immune cells. This is tied to the loss of magnetic ability due to the lack of oxygen tension generation in older, worn out mitochondria. The same effect happens in those with autoimmunity and cancer. When mitochondria are older, they lose oxygen tensions and magnetic abilities. This diminishes the ability to re-energize our tissues with electrons while we sleep. This is why sharing blood between older and younger animals has such a dramatic effect on the older animal. It makes them younger because they regain the ability to re-energize their tissues with electrons at night. Okay, so this is basically the reason why older people die. Okay? Every disease, every death is related to is in some form, some form of oxygen deprivation. And oxy electrons move through the electron chain transport to get to oxygen, to reduce the oxygen. Once they reduce the oxygen, they turn back into electrons and they go through the same process. And it goes over and over again. It's happening millions of times throughout the day in your body on a quantum level without you even thinking about it. Okay? So that's why if the electrons slow down or the protons start building up, okay, then we have less oxygen. And the fact that people don't know how to breathe correctly is another issue. And the fact that people are putting face masks, face diapers, whatever you want to call them, on their face, which is basically causing them not to breathe as well. As well. So, anything that reduces oxygen is bad. Any way that you can... So, blue light will cause you to reduce your oxygen because it will... Any form of non-native MF will reduce your oxygen because non-native MF, the number one problem with it is it dehydrates the cell. Mitochondria, your proteins, they don't work properly without water. 